Previously on Guiding Light. What is he doing here? He's supposed to be locked up. He took my daughter away from me once before. All I could think about was getting that gun out of his hands. And I swear I would have shot him. I can't believe it's been a year since I lost you. Life goes on. So many things have changed. Some are good, some are just confusing. Some are so sad. Coop was so young. Your family's in a lot of pain. And I want to do everything I can to help them, Nikki. They've been so good to me. Almost done. These boxes just need to be taped up, so. Frank. Frank. Yeah. I'm not just talking about packing. No, oh, I'm sorry. Hey. Yeah, you've been there for me and Rafe more times than I can count, and I just want to return the favor. So just tell me, is there anything that I can do? Anything? You know what, Natalia? I really appreciate the offer. It's just that. It's been a really brutal week. Coop gone now and Dad giving up company. I don't, I don't understand. Why, why would he do that? My take is that he just doesn't want to walk into company and not see Coop at his laptop like he always was, you know? Look, I'm sorry. Um, how you doing? You know, I, I, I saw you and Olivia fighting outside the funeral home. Is everything all right? Oh, just, what else is new? Livy and I, we don't really just, you know, agree on much anyway. It's just how we are, I guess. Hmm. I guess I can make for a long day sometimes. Listen, do you mind helping me out uh, um, with that bookcase? Some of the books there? Yeah. Thanks. I need to know why you're here. Are you armed? No. But that's really your thing these days, isn't it? It's very Alan of you. Mm. <clears throat> Sorry about that. Sorry about many things. What I did to Emma. You made my life a living hell. I'd say we both caused each other a lot of pain. So what now? Everything's good? You heard Coop's memorial. You heard what I said. I have no interest in picking up where I left off. I want to make amends and move on. Just like that. No. I mean, I, I, I know it'll take time, but thankfully I have time. I got that second chance that everybody hopes for. So that's me. What about you? You may as well spit it out. I know why you're here. You want to know what I'm going to do about Emma, and you want to know what I think about this living arrangement that you have with our daughter and another woman. Emma writes an innocent essay for her fourth grade class, and next thing I know, I've got politicians and parents and half the town making innuendos about my alternative lifestyle. And then you show up afterwards. It's not a coincidence. You want to know if I'm corrupting our daughter. No, I... Emma is one of the reasons that I came back. That's true. But I didn't know anything about your alternative lifestyle. Is it true? No. It's... a bunch of ridiculous gossip being spread by a bunch of narrow-minded idiots. It's nothing. Olivia, you don't care about gossip. So what's got you so worked up? Living with Olivia is challenging, but... Well, if you, uh, if you ever want to talk about it, I'm here for you. I know that Olivia can be Olivia sometimes, and life isn't always easy with her. You're doing it again. What's that? <laughs> trying oh. to help me and I'm supposed to be helping you. No, no, That's I'm what crying. you do all the time. No, you do that with, you know, with me and Rafe. You do it with your dad, your entire family. 
couldn't help my brother. I don't think there's anything you could have done. Love makes people crazy. I know I'm too late for Coop, but I wish there was something I could do for my father. Being there for Buzz is enough. And I wanna, I wanna, I really wanna help. I wanna just do something, anything. I honestly can't think of anything that you can do.